It took 10 years to develop, according to the researchers. And it might be a new form of protection against COVID-19. It's an antiviral coating called MAP-1. It's already in use in Hong Kong. It's non-toxic and reportedly safe for the skin and the environment. And it can be applied onto surfaces that are frequently touched, like elevator buttons or handrails, as well as inside houses and flats. The coating can kill uh, numbers of virus, for example, coronavirus, a flu virus, and something like novel virus. Uh, also, we kill, it can kill a lot of bacteria. And in terms of the, uh, the validity, it can last up to 90 days. The substance works through millions of nanocapsules that contain disinfectants, unlike common disinfecting methods, such as diluted bleach and alcohol. This spray is heat sensitive. When somebody touches on it, uh, the uh, polymer material can feel the temperature increase from the body heat, and they will open up and release the disinfectant. And once you remove your hand, uh, they will close up, and thus conserving this disinfectant. Hong Kong is one of the most densely populated cities in the world, which makes it an ideal place for the coronavirus to spread. The MAP-1 coating has already been sprayed around the homes of more than a thousand low-income families. If there is a confirmed case in the building, we may get infected easily. I'm worried about it. After he sprayed the coating, there is a protective layer. I feel like it has strengthened our protection against viruses. Following clinical tests at a Hong Kong hospital and care home earlier this year, it's now been made available for commercial use. Its research and development predates the COVID-19 pandemic by many years. But if it's as effective as the researchers claim, it could be a significant tool in controlling the future spread of the epidemic. Francis Collings, TRT World.